Hey guys, welcome back to this series of One vs. Ones. Today we're joined by Omni Cabo on the top, or as the blue side, playing Nidalee, and... And Mr. Mr. Poopy Man on the purple side. Yeah, the infamous Mr. Poopy Man. And I am commentating with Recon, the last winner of the last series. Of three. Yeah, this is going to be a Who two out of three match. Omni Cabo. Yeah, it's going to be best of three. Or best, no, it's best two out of three, obviously. Yeah. And we're using the new spectator mode, which is in beta right now. Yeah. Hopefully, it's out long enough to where we can finish this series with. Thirty uh, seconds until minions spawn. Whoever wins this versus recon. So that's it. Okay. Now let's look around. Jax gets his E first. Nearly getting her Q first. Obvious. Let's see the items. Boots of speed and three health potions. Good Thorns choice ring. on the boots. It's where you can dodge the spears early. You know. And I'm not sure what the idea behind picking Jax was. He's he's better against attack damage champions. Although he does have that gap closer. Looks like a little bit of dancing going on. <laughs> <laughs> or laughing. I can't tell. Okay, and uh Nidalee went with exhaust and teleport, which was what seemed to be her maker last time when Recon chose it, and he went Mr. Poopy Man went with <laughs> that's such a goofy name. Ghost and Exhaust. And yeah, they are in this call, but this is not live, it's three minutes off. Yeah. So let's see who will win this first map. Here comes the minions. And I don't know who's going to win this. It's going to be a pretty hard one to win. Oh, Ooh. and to make this more dramatic, um, Mr. Poopy Man is Omni Cabo's brother. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, these aren't the pros, guys. These are just normal Average level 30s. Role players. I think he just hit level 30. Mr. Yeah, but he's been playing Nidalee for a while, and I don't know how Mr. Poopyman has been playing Jax. This is actually the first time I've ever seen him play it. But he does have a skin, so... Jaximus. Yeah. Jaximus. Probably his best skin, in my opinion. French maid versus Jaximus. <laughs> pretty, pretty cool skins. Okay, they're both at level 2. Okay, you are on the same. I was wondering if you're at the same time as me. Yeah, with Nidalee taking her missing her surge, spear. so that she can heal herself. Looks like Leap Strike finally getting learned. And Jax taking his stun. No, he got he got he actually got the ooh some little aggression there, but right. ooh he dodges the attack. Ooh. Oh, you are behind. Oh, whatever. It's probably by like a little second now. Yeah. Oh, it is no big deal. You'll see the action in a second. Okay, mm -hmm. back to the commentary. Looks like the purple missions are push, pushing to the turret to where it's going to be kind of challenging for Nidalee to uh, Farm. last hit under the turret. But she does have a substantial lead. Main reason, probably because she's melee. So she is. I mean, <laughs> she is not melee. Jax is melee. And Jax is going to have a little bit harder time farming. He's going to make use of his W. That really helps in the farming phase for Jax. Yeah. It costs like one mana. 20 mana, I should say, but... Really low mana cost. Looks like the turrets are pushing to the tower again. Not good minions. I mean, pff, turrets. <laughs> <laughs> that would be weird. That'd be horrible. <laughs> turrets pushing through turrets. No, that oh would God. be. This game would be weird. Okay. Yeah, I have no idea who is going to win this. Still hasn't gotten his W yet. I'm not sure what he's trying to prove with this. Cause he really wants his stun. Unless he's going attack damage. Um, well, he does have boots. Nothing. I don't know what the idea cool. behind his build is. Runes, obviously. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Oh. Press C if you clicked on him. No, it looks like he's got ability power. So. Huh? Yeah, and he doesn't have a Dorans. And he got hit by a spear, which would have been pretty easy to dodge. Oh well. No big deal. Ooh, yeah, that spear. Not too much damage, but. If he gets, he keeps on getting hit by those, then he's gonna that get, won't be very great for him. He's gonna have to go back, but popping a health potion, letting him stay in lane. Good idea on the health potions. In fact, if I were playing a one versus one, I'd probably start out with an elixir just to help get the first blood. You know, maybe. Yeah, you get the early first blood if you're really trying. Yeah, if you if you. But if you don't get the early first blood, that really screws up your build. Yep. But looks like a huge push by Blue here. And making it a little harder for Jax to last hit. But he's yeah. still... 
I mean, he's pretty far behind. But Nidalee, also not the best hit, last hit earn, I should say, farmer. She's fine at last hitting. She's not the best farmer until level 6, and then she's really good at farming. So nothing happening. Yeah, not too much aggression right now. Slight lead. Oh, nice fear to the face for Jax. You'd think Jax would uh, try to dodge it because he got boots first. Not sure why you would put a trap down. Unless <laughs> he goes missing. Oh, whatever. Probably used oh. to playing Nidalee a certain way. And yeah, in my GP game. I think I tried to gank him. Gank the other GP through the bushes, so. Uh -huh. It is a pretty good idea to actually gank him this. Because you get the advantage of hitting him first. Looks like they both just got their ulti. Uh, not sure who has a better ulti here. I'm gonna have to go with Nidalee action. Yeah, for now. Jax's is really good, but... You have to get some attack speed for first. Yeah. Get like Genshu's Rage get, Blade. Yeah, get some attacks off and then, then you're, you start getting better. Miss Spear, but looks like from some aggression in Cougar form. But Jax just jumps right back onto her. Gets a dodge. I think that was just a minion. But might want to go for something since he has to go. Not sure. Hits a spear. Not much damage from the spears yet. But soon, they will. Looks like Jax might be going B here. Yep, he is. Italy gonna try to get a spear off, but he's gonna dodge. So, Nidalee's getting some free farm here. Yeah. Especially since she brought teleport and he did not. She's healing herself so she can kill that turret faster. Not a bad idea. And might go back after this wave, I'm not sure, so. Yeah, I'd go back right now. Do as much damage as you can to the turret and teleport right back. Cause yep, looks like. Uh. Took our advice. They could tell in the future we we're gonna say that, and they're like, that's a good idea. <laughs> So that you wouldn't be too far behind in uh, items. Looks like Nidalee's probably gonna use her teleport just to get back to lane. So, oh, gonna teleport on a minion actually. Jax waiting around that minion anxiously, but. With his ninja tab eye. Ninja tab eye. Three new health potions. Now, if I were Jax, I would probably try to counter the Nidalee rather than get ninja tab eye. But ninja tab eye is pretty essential on him. Yeah, get more dodges off, get more stuns off. I would probably go with Merc Treads, just, ooh, looks like a leap, and he gets the proc off on his ult, and a dodge! And, Nidalee, maybe, potentially, but stays in lane with her heal, it's gonna farm these minions, or try to kill Jax, but Jax dodges, I mean, jumps away. Uh, that was a nice jump Yeah, from Jax. Ooh, looks like something might happen here, he got a stun. They're just gonna have to be careful and wasting an, wasting an exhaust to keep him away. Not sure how necessary that was, but that would be bad because you know the first kill is what ends this. Yeah. Got to be careful, as careful as possible. Uh, Nidalee still with a slight lead in the gold, so that's one thing going good for her. Got to be careful because Jax does have a boatload of damage. If he gets a dodge, he's gonna jump on you. Nidalee pretty useless if she's stunned. Yep. And with her low health right now. It'd be pretty bad if she got stunned. Yeah. You could you could actually power dive at this point if you really wanted to. Yeah, if you had a nice stun then Yeah, if you had a stun. Uh yep. not Looks like Nidalee kinda low on mana. So not gonna be able to heal herself as much. And misses a spear, that's not good for her. That mana is gonna drop. Ooh, looks like a jump going on, but. Ooh, oh, looks like this might be the end. Yep, that's the end. So, in this series, Jax gets the first blood. Nidalee with unnecessary aggressiveness at low HP. Yeah. What do you have to say for yourself, Omni? You're right healed. Uh huh. Um. I <laughs> I thought I could get away with my cougar, but I just couldn't pull it off. Uh -huh. Apparently he's pro Jax, so that's why. Now let's continue on to game two of this exciting, exciting one vs one series. And yeah, don't forget to comment, subscribe, leave a like, leave a like.
And Anything you can tell us who so. you think is going to win this. Right now, it looks like Jax, or Hint. should I say, Mr. Poopy Man. Yeah, <laughs> Poopy Man. Okay, um, that's it. See ya.